I am on the set of Master Chef Singapore. One of the most popular cooking shows in the world is back again to season our shores. The contestants workstations, the iconic clock that's going to count down all the challenges. Chef Damien, he's one of the esteemed judges. Will you please show me around sure. this beautiful sure. set? The equipment is the state of the art, allows the contestants to actually use whatever skills they have to the best. Pantry in there, top to the brim with anything you can think of. Your judging panel? We usually either in front when we start off, when we taste, we always stand at the back. This yeah. actually looks like this. All the cutlery. I'm here today because DBS is a partner. Preparations have been ongoing for an episode that we'll be part of. I could hardly sleep a beat. This is going to be the most exciting thing I've thought about since my childhood. It'll have a culinary challenge around reducing food waste. Something we're really hoping to raise awareness and take action on. And that's why we've come on board this season. The episode is currently being filmed inside this building. We've got three colleagues who are on air. Come on into the MasterChef kitchen. Welcome, welcome. These guys are from DBS Bank's team, Zero Food Waste Warriors. I'm outside because of safety measures, right? Can't have too many people on set. We're just done with the first part of our filming. And um, as you can hear, they're chasing sparrows out of the studio right now. Huh? We were filming halfway when suddenly all the sparrows behind us. There they Hi. are. Hello, Nadia. How was it like? It was awesome. I was just so scared. And I was like thinking, please, please do not say the wrong things. For example, if you roast a chicken or beef, you would have the meat drippings, which you can keep. <gasps> the moment we, we went in, you could feel the, the massiveness of what's happening. Wow. How much accuracy there needs to be. And it, this accuracy is expected from everyone. What actually happened on the episode? We gave them the challenge of zero or little food waste. We brought in the mystery ingredients that the contestants had to cook with, carrying the boxes with no clue what was inside. <laughs> Did you have to tell yourself like, don't drop the tray, don't drop the tray. Absolutely. <laughs> and, and also, don't walk too fast. Producers gave us certain clues to share with the contestants. Do you want to give it a shot? Yeah. Guess what this item is? What comes first? Yeah. What? <laughs> Salad. Appetizer. No! What? The egg? Yes! Yeah, yeah, we got it! There'll be cameramen, but we're not allowed to look at the cameraman. So we have to pretend like certain things are not there, react accordingly. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of like what's happening right here, right? Something there is a camera like looking at us. <laughs> so you have your cameras, right, coming in, you know, right there, shooting, filming whatever's been cooking, whatever happens, someone someone cuts the finger. It happens, right? You're rushing. Contestants who are really, really good. And when that person made a mistake, I'm not the kind of person to cry, but I feel it here. Trust me. When we watch a show, you don't realise how much work goes behind, how much time it takes, so many things that's happening. The scary thing is that you don't even realise this. you're doing these little nuances to do better and more with less. Like looking away, just your, your eyeball just moving for a moment. And then you got to retake. I was growing up and I was always watching it and learning things from what the judges said or the contestants did. To actually be on this set was, was really a dream come true. We hope you enjoyed this tour of the MasterChef Singapore set. See you next time.